The shotgun pubic bone technique helps to align the pubic bones. The pubic bones are right here in the front of the pelvis. This bone is a support for your bladder, your uterus, and the pelvic floor muscles. The pelvic floor muscles support your organs and connect to your bladder. When this bone is out of alignment, you may have more symptoms, feel less power and strength, or have pain in your back, pelvis, and or the perineal areas. This technique is helpful for somebody who has pubic bone pain, back, pelvic, or perineal pain, weakness of the core and or pelvic floor, pelvic floor dysfunction, and bladder issues like incontinence, urge, and pressure. Aligning this bone will make it more easy and comfortable to perform everyday activities. You can do this exercise while lying down or sitting in a chair with your feet supported. So the equipment that you would need would be a belt, and then you can choose between something firm like a yoga block, a ball, or a rolled up blanket or mat. You'd want to lie down with your head supported on a pillow or something so that your head is neither too far back or too far forward. You want your hips and knees bent and your hips and, and knees and feet are all hip width apart. Then you want to place a belt around your thighs, wrap it around your feet and place the belt around your lower thighs. Now press your thighs out into the belt without allowing movement to occur. Keep your breath flowing and you're gonna hold this contraction, hold this press for 10 seconds, for 10 second count. Six, seven, eight, and then relax. Good. And repeat. And you can repeat this exercise three to ten times. We'll do it two more times. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Relax. And once more. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Relax. So after you've performed three to ten repetitions, then take your ball or rolled up mat and place it in between your knees. And now you're going to press for ten seconds into the ball again without a lot of excessive motion. Keep your breath flowing throughout the exercise. So 10 seconds here. And then you can continue to do this after you relax. Repeat it again for a total of three to 10 times. If you were doing this seated, you want to sit at the edge of the chair and sit up nice and tall. You want your knees in line with your hips and your ankles. Okay, so here's what this looks like in sitting. You want to take the belt and place it just above your knees. And then you're going to push out into the belt for a count of 10 seconds, doing this three to 10 times. When you're finished with that, remove the belt. place the ball in between your knees and once again squeeze firmly and comfortably into the ball keep your breath flowing for 10 seconds 
repeating three to ten times, pressing inward. So with this exercise, you should not be experiencing any pain. Please check with your physical therapist to be sure that this exercise is right for you.